creating relationships. In the last video, you imported data from spreadsheets into your custom app. Now it's time to link your tables together by creating relationships between the tables. This will complete the structure you planned in your ERD. Download the files for this video as it contains features to help you through the lesson. In your Clinics app, you may want to see a client record and a list of their visits all in one place. In FileMaker Pro, you can do this by displaying related records using a tool called a portal. On the client layout, you'll see an empty portal on the right side. This is where a client's visits will appear once you've set up the relationship. Open the Manage Database window by choosing File, Manage, Database, then click the Relationships tab. Each square represents a table in your app. To create a relationship, drag a line between the key fields of two tables. Start by creating a relationship from Client to Visit. Click and drag from the Client ID field in the Client table to the Client ID field in the Visit table. As you drag, a line appears. This line is what creates the relationship. Click OK. The portal now shows all visits for that specific client. Ada's client ID is 1. Any visit with a matching client ID of 1 will show in this portal. You'll see that Ada has visited your clinic four times. If you flip to the next record, you'll see that Molly has only visited twice. Open Manage Database again so that you can finish creating your relationships between the other two tables, Visit and Service. This relationship will allow you to see the services that took place during a visit. Drag the Visit ID from the Visit table to the Visit ID from the Service table. If you make a mistake, you can delete a relationship between two tables. Simply click the box in the middle of a relationship line and hit the Delete key. You'll need this relationship, so if you do test deleting it, be sure to redraw it. Click OK. Switch to the Visit layout, where you'll see a portal showing related services for each visit. You'll also see that the layout includes the client's first name and last name fields. These are actually the fields from the client table. Since you created a relationship between client and visit, you're able to view visit data from a client layout as well as client data from the visit layout. In this video, you created relationships between your tables of data so you can see a client's visits easily and see the services given in each visit. Your ERD is now fully represented in your custom app. In the next lesson, you'll modify your layouts to help users interact with your data.